Hi, I'm Brian and I'm here today to introduce you to sheet metal. So welcome to the shop, come on in. A lot of people don't realize what a sheet metal worker does. We're one of those trades, we're not as big as maybe a carpenter or a plumber where most people have an understanding of what we do. Uh, in a general sense, we build anything out of metal. And what we do is take something two-dimensional or flat piece of metal and we transform it into something three-dimensional. And there's a huge array of different projects or products that we'll build uh, with all those in mind. So I've put a few out on the table here as examples. One of our biggest areas that a sheet metal worker will work in is known as heating, ventilation and air conditioning in industry. So if we looked up at the ceiling and saw all the pipes and ductwork up above here, that's about 60% of what sheet metal workers do. And we design, build, install and maintain those systems. So a couple examples of fittings that we'll make something like that, a rain cap. Or this one is called a squared around. Different shapes, but they all start the same way as a flat piece of metal. Another large area that sheet metal workers work in is known as the custom area of sheet metal. And for that, we'd look at something like this, maybe a stainless steel barbecue. So they're usually one-off uh, products. Um, go to a custom shop, it could be aluminum, it could be stainless steel. Uh, and again, it starts off two-dimensional, just a flat piece of metal, and then we create the shapes and patterns we need to make it into a three-dimensional shape. Another area we work in is aircraft. So all planes are made of uh, metal, typically aluminum, and sheet metal workers will, again, build the components to create an aircraft. This here is a very common uh, piece of equipment we use in the sheet metal shop. It's a handbrake. And what we do is, is clamp our material inside that handbrake, uh, move the bending leaf here, and that bends our material. You can see we have about six or eight different brakes in the shop, and they range in size. And the bigger they are, the heavier um, or thicker material they can bend. Over on the side of the shop here, this is our soldering station. So a lot of our components need to be sealed or waterproof. And so we'll do soldering here. And again, it's a little different than other trades where you solder like a plumber. We don't use a torch, we use what's called a soldering iron. We have multiple benches with smaller machines uh, that all have a, a, set, a different purpose. So different processes for different machines. This one's a, a small hand, uh, bench here. All of these ones, we can put different wheels on them. So if we look at this one that's got a set on, and this wheel will do one operation and that's it. It's got a specific purpose and that's, that's the only job it does. Our uh, bench here is uh, just full of, of stock material and this is our shearing bench. So this is where we cut our metal. This is the first stage of anything we do with a piece of uh, sheet metal, is cut it from sheet form into the size that we require for the, for the job. And that's what these machines are here. So we'll stick it in, there's two knives, and it cuts the material. We also have a large one which is power operated instead of manual, off to the side here. Well, we're at this end of the shop. If we look up, we can see uh, one of our pro uh, former projects from a class building an airplane. So we had mentioned uh, aircraft is part of sheet metal work. And, and that was a aircraft specific class that built that, um, that airplane that we display now. At this end of the shop, we keep all our material uh, that we stock regularly. We utilize uh, installation methods with our shed here and we, we do two components with this. We do uh, residential installation, so we'll put the heating, ventilation and air conditioning that you'd see in a home. Uh, we install that in our shed here as well as what's called architectural sheet metal. And architectural sheet metal is the uh, exterior components of a building that make it look nice and, and keep the weather out. And we'll, we'll do that, we'll do actual installations on our shed, uh, inside and out. We're under cover, so we're, we don't usually work out in the weather, but we will utilize the outdoors uh, all year round for installation uh, components. Included in our training uh, in sheet metal is, is drafting. Drafting and what we refer to as layout. 
and layout is where we make the, the patterns that we go into the shop and form. So this is our drafting room. Uh, we do all of our classroom theory in here, uh, but mostly we do our, our drafting. Um, when, we, when we set out to do our drafting, and it's one of the nice components of sheet metal work, and it's one part that I always enjoyed. We get to take them from start to finish from the drafting room, make the patterns, take it into the shop, do all our forming, and create the project or object from that.